There is a belief on the part of some that when it comes to servant leadership, they will hold hands, sit by the campfire, and sing Kumbaya. Some people even believe that servant leadership is a soft approach to leading effectively. However, the Pastoral Institute's definition of servant leadership contradicts this mindset, as it reads, Servant leadership is a lifelong journey that includes the discovery of oneself, a desire to serve others, and a commitment to lead. If you unpack this definition, you will notice three things. First, servant leadership is a journey, and while we are on our journey, there are lots of peaks and valleys. However, if we're in a constant state of awareness, there are lessons to be learned from both. Second, the most important characteristic of a servant leader is self-awareness. Understanding who you are, what are your strengths, what are your weaknesses, and most importantly, what is your purpose? The third and final part of the definition of servant leadership is the desire to serve others and a commitment to lead. Servant leaders have a distinct calling. They are change agents and are often marked men and women. Therefore, you have to want to do this. After all, you signed up to be the leader. You signed up to be the doctor. You signed up to be the teacher. You signed up to be the manager. You signed up to be the father. With positions of leadership comes great responsibility. Servant leadership is selfless service. Servant leaders who hold positions of authority understand that it is not about the parking spot. For them, servant leadership is a way of life.